Welcome back to X-Men Legends 2, the sequel to the game that I cannot play because it's not uh, out on PC, the first one that is. Um, let's begin with going by going up to Forge and buy some uh, some things. Last episode, if you didn't see, Die we again. beat. What can I get you? Oh. We beat not only one, but two bosses. Well, four, but y yeah, whatever. So uh, that's pretty cool. We beat the, s the th what I believe to be the third horseman. Did you need help with anything? Um, no thanks. But uh, and I think the last of the four horsemen is going to be Mr. Sinister. So, and I think we're going to battle him soon. If you look at them, um, that's just. Uh, See this? Uh, where is it? Oh yeah, objectives. The next one. Destroy the supercomputer model on... Oh, the m supercomputer. Wait. Oh yeah, we did that. Oh. Wait, we didn't do this? Oh, talk to Professor X. <laughs> okay. So, maybe we're not supposed to battle Professor X. Uh, I mean, Mr. Sinister. Next. Of course we're not going to battle Professor X. <laughs> that would be... That would be kind of weird. So, but we're going to talk to him. Hey. Good job at temple. It has been completely disbanded. But I have some bad news. While on a reconnaissance mission of Apocalypse's Tower in New York City, Angel was captured. I <gasps> do not know his fate, but I can only imagine the worst. Oh shit. Wait, did he say bad newt? I'm certain I heard him say, but I have some bad newt. I, I that might just have been me. I don't know. <laughs> and what the hell happened to Sunfire? That's kind of weird. But okay, so Angel. Yeah, I already guessed this. I really can't see what the four have in common. Huh. Anyway, let's continue. How did Apocalypse create such an... Oh. We're done in, here in Canada. Can we move on? Are you sure you want to leave Canada? Not really. I would actually like to go to Canada. I really, it's one of the countries where uh, that and Ukraine, the two countries probably I want to visit the most. Uh, and maybe, s well, there's a few others too. Um, but um, yeah, let's leave. Wee! I <laughs> said, oh. Huh? How may I be of assistance? What of the spy we captured? He has adapted to the genetic splicing even better than hoped. Show him to me. Angel, come forth and meet your master. The name Angel no longer applies. Uh -huh. What would you have us call you? Dumb. I am Archangel, oh. a horseman of Apocalypse, and I am yours to command. Your speed and strength have been augmented. But what of your soul? My soul is filled with hatred, rage, and death for the X-Men. Ooh, that's cool. Oh, are we at the Westchester, uh, the Xavier Mansion thing? In Westchester, I think it's called. I think we are. Welcome to my home, or <laughs> rather, what's left of my home. Apocalypse was quite thorough in its destruction. Okay, who does Jubilee? No doubt all of you have heard that Angel was recently caught by Apocalypse during a scouting mission. His fate remains a mystery. Okay. I can only hope Angel takes strength from the fact that our mission in Canada was a success. The core and the Infinite Factory were disabled, and the Madrai Temple has been disbanded. In light of that, Apocalypse's plans of conquest have been quashed. So why are we here? Shouldn't we be rescuing Angel, Polaris, Quicksilver, and Emma Frost? Those are just four lives. We have a greater responsibility to the millions of people in New York City. 
We must free them from the tyranny of Apocalypse. It isn't going to be easy. Apocalypse's military is dug in everywhere. Agreed. But once we've explored New York, we should be able to formulate a plan of attack. For your first missions, talk to Moira or Havoc. Good luck to you. Okay. Hey. Okay. So, cool fact. Um, oh, that's Moira. I didn't think that was Jubilee. Sorry about that. But, uh... That's because it looks like her a bit from afar. Anyway, cool fact is that Angel, I think I mentioned this before, was Angel was actually the first horseman, the first death horseman of Apocalypse, so that's pretty cool that they uh, choose him again. Let's level up quickly. Mm, skills. I think I'm going to do... Uh, one of the passive ones. Iron Eyes is pretty good. It uh, gives him immunity to stuff. <laughs> to stuff. Uh, and let's do Gambit. And, uh, okay, let's go up. Really like, um, the Staff Assault. I really use that a lot, so I'm gonna do that one. Okay, so. I think we'll talk to Moira since she's right here. Greetings, X-Man. It's been a while, hasn't it? <laughs> um, she's dead in the comic books. Spoiler alert. Oh, it's been a, it's actually been like a lot of years since she died, but still. Okay. Hi, Moira. What news have you got of, uh, f got for us? To get Apocalypse out of New York City, we'll have to battle him in his tower. But we first have to get into his tower, which, from all indications, is impossible. I don't like her voice. I think it's great that she speaks with a Scottish accent, stuff like that, or is it an Irish? I'm really not sure about that. But, I, I don't know, the voice just don't... With the image I had of her, it doesn't fit. I don't know. Come on now, Moira. Uh, with you, nothing is impossible. Well, there may be a solution. Look up Sebastian Shaw in New York City. If anyone would know how to get into that tower, it'd be him. She sounds, I don't know, older. Look at the photo as well, if not photo picture. She sounds a lot older than the picture. I don't know. Any suggestions how to get into the city? There's no way we can take the X jet. We've been shut. We we'd be shut down in seconds. Quite right. Your best bet for entering New York City undetected would be the sewers. There's an entrance near the mansion. Okay. If you'd like more information, use the mission briefing computer by Charles. By Charles? As is in he he made it? <laughs> I know that she means right next to him, but yeah. Okay. Uh what have you been up to, Doctor? Since the attack on New York, I've been helping treat the wounded. Just recently I've begun working with the underground. The underground? Aye. We've set up an underground railroad of sorts that helps those fleeing the city. Oh, cool. Uh, who's in charge of the underground? An old acquaintance of ours, Marrow. Marrow, she's co she she's quite a psychopath. It's really weird about Marrow. She, the first time you meet Marrow, she kills like hundreds of people, murders them in cold blood, and then she later becomes a member of X Men. It's kind of fucked up, if you ask me. Uh, Storm actually killed her. Well, she ripped. Uh, Mero had two hearts, and Storm ripped out one of them. I'm not sure whether or not Storm knew she had two hearts. So, Mero, she's a Morlock. Why would she help humans? Let's just say she learned a lesson in kindness when the X Men saved her people from the Gerso soldiers. I believe she's attempting Gr to pay back that kindness. Gerso? Okay. Morlocks uh, are mutants living uh, underground in the some t underground tunnels beneath New York. They have taken the name from uh, the Time Machine by H. G. Wells, where the on the, the in the where the people living under the ground in the distant future call are called Morlocks. Just some backstory. Um continue. Okay. What do you know about Sebastian Shaw? I know he's the leader of the Hellfire Club. And yeah. he has little love for the X-Men. I also know he gave information to Angel about the Infinite Factory. 
Could Shaw have been the reason Angel was caught by Apocalypse? No. Shaw hates Apocalypse as much as we do, and that's why he might be willing to tell us how to get into that tower. Okay. Okay, thanks for the information, Moira. You're quite welcome, my friend. Yeah, she sounds too old. No offense to whoever voiced her. <laughs> but um, let's uh wait. Oh, wait, no, no. Um that one. Which mission briefing would you like? I would like nothing <laughs> locating Sebastian Shaw. Wait, is that what I'm doing now? I should have probably have paid attention to what the hell was going on. Oh my Before god. We can hope to defeat Apocalypse, we must first determine how to gain entry to his stronghold. You want us to go inside Apocalypse's tower? <laughs> That's daft. It can't be done. Watch it, Toad. Right, right. I almost forgot. We're one big, happy, dysfunctional family. Yeah. If I may continue. Moira believes Sebastian Shaw might be of help. Huh. Shaw's bad Interesting. News, He's the head of the Hellfire Club, and they aren't exactly big fans of the X-Men. I understand, Vision. But it's because of his unsavory connections that he might know secrets of Apocalypse. He also might want to hand us over for a nice reward. Aye. Somehow, this has got to figure into Destiny's prediction. Toad, I ain't warning you again. Ah, uh, all right. So what do you <laughs> want us to do, Professor? What prediction? Travel to New York City and find Mr. Shaw. Then see if he has the information we desire and what he would like in return. How about we persuade him the old-fashioned way? Wolverine, ain't you ever gonna learn? You can't solve every problem with your fist. Don't know. Ain't never run across a problem I couldn't solve with my fists. <laughs> no, there will be no violence against Mr. Shaw. Simply find him and see if we can reach an agreement. Any questions? Then good luck to you. I, I, I didn't... Any questions? No, then don't. He doesn't wait for an answer. Who the hell's this? And why can't I get... Uh, who's this? And why is she... Is this Shadow Cat? Kitty Pride. That is Shadow Cat. Cool. She's uh, just standing there, looking at a bench. And who's this? This is Havoc. Cool. We got our hero stash. Yeah, let's um, head out. Wait, this is in. Never mind, let's head out then. <laughs> Where's the exit? Does this hold the exit? Oh. Sewers. So we're gonna fight the Morlocks now? Huh. Hello? Anybody home? Holy shit! So this is what New York sewers look like. And everybody's always been afraid of the alligators. Maybe they should have been afraid of the big ass ants. Kill it. Hey. Oh, yeah. And by the way, there is no alligators in New York sewers. Never have been, never will be. They can't survive down there. Because they need sunlight to survive so yeah that's just one big urban legend hmm what's this hey get out of my way huh just some scrap oh hello nice to meet you I'm gonna do... No, I'm, I think I'll control Wolverine for a bit. Sure thing. Sure thing. Bub. Let's teach him a lesson. Whoa, what the hell? Moloch Claw. So we are gonna find the Molochs. Whoa. Look, a homing beacon. But we aren't going to be able to get it to it unless we find some way to shut down this fan. 
Oh, thanks, Gambit. Nice of. Okay. Look, a homing. Okay, yeah. Uh -huh. Awesome. Can, can we just... Okay, yeah, I'm trying to get... Well, why, we, why would we want that homing beacon? I can't remember what it does. I don't know. Let's get this to go this way. Let's give you some health. Ah! Oh god, I hadn't seen that do with one of those. Okay. Stand still! Oh, I hate these. Oh, thanks, camera. I'm doing what it says. Four, four, six. Four, four, six. Four, four, six. Oh my god. Have I, have I mentioned that this is so fucking broken? I'm just mashing buttons right now because it, it doesn't work when I do it the right way so will you please just fucking die you stupid ass ants four four six you Oh, thank you. Finally. But yeah, they should not put that in the, the third game if they decide to make one. I hope they do, because this is a fun game. Oh, hello. I thought you were dead. Yeah, burn that motherfucker. I'll destroy some of these crates in the meantime. In the meantime. Hey, he's not dead. Kill him. Would you... Jeez. My companions are idiots. Yeah, the, Oh my god. Oh, oh. Okay, he's dead. Move out of the way, please. Some help, guys? Wait. Thought I destroyed the wall. Where's that? Oh, that destroyed this? Yes, I did. Yeah. So, I thought the Morlocks were our friends. I guess they're not in this universe. Well, the Morlocks kinda is not the friends in any universe. It depends on what Morlocks you're talking about, I guess. Who said that? Oh, that guy. Wait, is someone resurrecting them? Really? Yeah, we better kill this chick. She seems like the... something important. <laughs> In your face. Yeah. Oh, hello. Good to see you there. I apologize, I'll get to you right away. Oh, I can destroy the campfire? That wouldn't be fair. Someone seems to be living down here. I'm, 
There's no reason to be a dick about it. Just because it's, a person is homeless doesn't mean you should destroy things. That didn't make sense. Why would you even to consider it? Uh oh? Uh oh. That was quite enjoyable. It was, yeah. Oh. Oh. He died. So we're going into New York through the sewers. And, uh. Ow. Killing everything on the way there. I guess. Oh, what the hell is that thing? Jesus Christ, look at what she's wearing. I'm not complaining. Wait, where did she go? Warlock Outsider. Oh wait, there's a... Once again, one of those mirrors. Jesus Christ. And she's a teleporter. Oh my god, how the fuck am I supposed to hit a girl that keeps teleporting away? That's... Oh my... Jesus fucking Christ! Oh fuck! Let me get out of here! Oh my god! Yeah, this really doesn't work. Oh, will you please stand still for just... Ow. Jesus fucking Christ, this is annoying. Oh, fucking hell. This is the worst thing in the game. Well, how the fuck am I supposed to do a combination if she doesn't stand still long enough for me to do the combination? I'm gonna kill this guy instead. Mostly because he annoys me. What's this bitch? Okay. Four. Oh my god. Four? Uh huh. Well. Four. Four. Si oh, fucking hell. Four. Four. Six. Four. Six. Four. Six. Oh my god. <laughs> Why the hell did they make this? Did they think people would fi find it fun? Oh fucking hell. Will you please just fucking stand still, you bitch? Oh my god! I, I've done this combination so many times now. I've even tried different speeds of button pressing. Oh, fucking hell. My fucking god, this is so lame. Wow. Great gameplay. Oh my fuck. Yeah, this is... Oh, sorry, hit the mic. This is really stupid. Right? 
What? Oh my god! Oh my fucking god, I really hate this part of the game. And I don't mean just it's annoying, this is really some, one, some extremely bad gameplay. Whoever put in this in the game should be fired. Because it's broken, it doesn't work. Playtest your games! That was quite enjoyable. Jesus. Okay. I think I'm gonna end the video here because that was just too much for me. <laughs> I really... Ugh. But uh, this has been a long video, uh, I think. We had the whole prequel and the cutscene, which was really awesome cutscene. I really love the way they made the Apocalypse look in this, uh, in this game. He looks amazing. But uh, yeah, I'll see you next time. Oh, wait. Let's just actually call up the portal. I don't get, they shouldn't have made it so you could have just saved anywhere in the game because you can always just bring up this portal so I don't see it's just what you really you're kind of just wasting time mostly just to get to a save it's a save state save point I don't know wait where is the save point is there no save wait can I not save the game are you... Oh. There it is. Wait, where? In here? What? Oh, outside. Okay, but uh, yeah. <laughs> I'll see you next time for more X-Men Legends 2. Bye.